Hey friends, welcome back to another video. It's Kayla Gambrell here. If you're new here, thank you so much for clicking on this video. And if you're a returning subscriber, hey girl, hey. Today's video is basically a vlog of me resetting and getting back into the good habits because we all know Tauruses thrive in having good habits and having a routine. We always talk about being that girl, but what we don't talk about is being that girl is so subjective to everyone's life. It's not one thing or the other thing that makes you be that girl, but it's all in what makes you feel good, what makes you feel happy, and what's your best routine. In this video, I will be resetting my that girl habits and getting it back into my routine since, you know, nursing school kind of bulldozed my routine. But yeah, I'm just doing things that I love, things that make me feel good, meditating in the morning. We'll get back into the list soon so I can let y'all know what I'm focusing on. But yeah, just come with me this week trying to reset, recharge and help me stay accountable girl like your girl needs it i'll help you you help me you get me Good morning, y'all. Let me turn down the air. Good morning, y'all. It's Kayla. Um, I'm just going to do an intro here. What's up, y'all? It's Kayla back with another freaking video. If you're new here, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to your girl's channel because you're going to love it here anyway. We do all things nursing, fashion, lifestyle, beauty over here. It's a little bit of everything. Today's video is going to be a creating my that girl habits, creating my that girl routine. Um, we already talked about it what being that girl is and you know a lot of people been doing it and you know i just finished class for the summer so we're literally about to be that girl all summer okay we're resetting and get ready for our senior year because now your girl is a senior i don't know if y'all knew i don't know if anybody told y'all but kayla gambrell is a, a nursing student senior okay period don't play with her but anyways, um, I'm still on an all-time high. I'm going to insert the clip of me yesterday just so y'all can get like my reaction. But I just want to still thank God. I'm so grateful for passing my exam. I got a 1,000, like I said, when I needed a 900. So I exceeded the bar of what I needed to do. And since I finished, I took my time out. I put my life on hold so that I could ensure that I was going to finish this course. Um, now it's time for me to get back and start doing the things that I enjoy doing. Hold on, y'all. But yeah, now it's time for me to get back into doing the things that I love. The gym. Ooh, content creating. And all that jazz. So it's time. About to go to the gym. I'm drinking my little Uptown. Hopefully, Uptime. Hopefully it really gives me some energy. I hope so. I'm not sure. But it has... A lot of caffeine so hope it gives me energy for the gym my mom, my mom. I'm on my way to the gym I'm not quite sure what I'm gonna do today I'm gonna for sure just start off kind of slight because it's been almost like what two months since I've been to the gym I forgot my camera so I'm literally holding my phone while I drive so I'm about to be putting it down but yeah so I'll catch y'all when we get to the gym. <laughs>
Papa. Hey y'all, I'm back. I just got out the shower. The gym was amazing. I had such a great first workout. Like, it definitely set the tone for the rest of the workouts that, you know, I'm gonna be having. I think I really wanna do some content. Okay, so. This week, like I said, is gonna be like that girl creating the habits that I wanna create for myself. So. We already did the gym. Um, kind of, actually, let's sit down and have a talk about what I'll be doing this week. Because I never really actually told y'all, which is kind of going with the flow. So I kind of want to let y'all know that way y'all can keep me accountable. Okay, so yeah. Like, like I said, I already kind of... I already kind of told y'all a little bit about it. But I wrote stuff down because I knew for sure that I was going to forget to like you know list everything so when it comes to me creating my good habits that I would like to do I want to get back into and majority of this stuff I used to already do but like I said when school gets super busy and when I feel like it's crunch time I literally knock all things out the window and I know I shouldn't be like that but that's how it makes me like zone in on what I really need to do so um one thing I want to get back into doing is like my morning routine as far as like devotional, doing like my daily devotional and meditating in the morning because that literally sets the day for me. Like I truly enjoy meditating and I feel like if y'all don't meditate, y'all really need to get into it just because it is a great way to start the day. Like depending on what the topic is, it just makes you hone in on like different topics, you know. Uh, being grateful resilience this morning my meditation was on resilience y'all kind of see me um the video of me meditating um for sure workouts i need to get this body it's not gonna be a summer body anymore because you know summer kind of already started but your girl gonna be setting good habits because by the time it's actually cool outside i'm gonna be outside because your girl don't like the heat and also i want to start eating healthy so this is something that i i used to okay i'm not gonna say that i was just eating so healthy but i had good healthy habits um like i wasn't eating past like eight o'clock nine o'clock sometimes and i definitely want to get back to that because i've been eating late and i know that's another reason why i've gained like weight since then so i'm about to go back to not eating past eight o'clock trying to um not eat past eight o'clock for sure nine o'clock but not eating past eight o'clock because that's when your body starts to you know get ready for the nighttime and the metab metabolism begins to slow down so also what i want to get back into doing is budgeting um i have a budget book i don't know if i've ever showed y'all my budget book but my cousin made it for me i'll have her instagram right here somewhere that way y'all can message her but she created this budget book for me and i'm I'm a spender, okay? Let's just say that. Y'all know that. I'm a spender. I love spending money. It don't matter if it's on bags, clothes, jewelry, like going out to eat because y'all know I'm a foodie. But um, I just love spending money and I need to start saving because I have a lot of things coming up. I have people's birthday. I have a lot of burgers coming up in September I need to pay for, trips that I need to pay, like, you know, that I need to save money for, a school books that I need to start paying for, you know? So, since I'm not about to be in school and I'm about to be working a lot, I told myself that I'm going to get back into budgeting. So, I have this budget book and I've been doing good for the past few weeks. But, um, yeah, I just want to kind of get back into that. And I'm also going to try to get my cousin to create me another budget book. It's going to be my sinking funds. So, things that I'm going to put small increments but try to save for a long time for. You know what I'm saying? Put like $5, 10 every now and then. But, it adds up so y'all know i don't know if y'all are new here this is my budget book i have different envelopes i feel like it's a great way especially if you're like a server or you're always getting cash because i'm way more willing to spend my cash because that's what i have the majority of and i'll be like oh well, i can make it back later so i have a spending funds and then i have bills so i put all my bills i know all my bills that i have for the month and i just put it in here at savings i am not doing too well with this but i started back doing it i have a self-care because you know your girl loves self-care 
I have gifts because like I said I have people's birthday coming up and I like to try to keep this flowing with money that way if I have a last minute gift I need to do I can't be like oh like you know I don't have no money I'll have money just for this that I have saved I have a vacation because you know vacations big or small it don't matter any vacation I save for and then miscellaneous which is like kind of like my rainy day and then lastly this is kind of just like a whatever folder whatever i'm saving for at the moment that i don't know what i'm saving for so for instance right now this is for my tattoos so i have my tattoos and my at-home self-care i just want to keep up with doing things that i like you know for me i love aesthetics i love self-care that just really makes me feel like cozy when i'm at home so just getting back into doing facials doing my nails my toes i already did my nails and i did my toes they're pink but um you know facials things like that so i definitely want to get back into that and also content creating and studying which i have i'm taking a break from studying right now just because i just finished the course for the month mm. excuse me and now i'm on summer vacation <laughs> so i'm not gonna start studying until about like a month from now or almost like you know a few weeks from now okay i'll start back studying a few weeks from now but right now your girl needs a break but um also creating content so Y'all know I love content creating. I'm doing YouTube. I do, you know, Instagram. If you don't follow me on Instagram, make sure you go follow me on Instagram. But, um, yeah, so basically that's it. I'm just creating the life that I love, getting back into doing things that I enjoy. And like I said, it's really subjective to everybody. Like, I encourage everybody to try and make good habits and do things that make them happy. So, be that girl, sis. Um, right now it's 2.49. It's about to be 3. I think I'm going to probably sit for an hour. Like I said, I want to create content. So today we're going to go create some content. Me and Ryan went out the other day and I wore this cute outfit but didn't get any pictures. So I'm about to put on that outfit again, do my makeup again, and then I'm going to go take some cute pictures. Um, probably by on this rooftop garage that I go to sometimes. Okay, y'all, so I haven't came back since I was watching TV, but I am now, it's 5.50, um, the sun's, like, good now, it's not super hot, so I'm about to go home, go out and take some content. I just wanted to come over here and show y'all the outfit. I did a TikTok on it, picking my outfit. So I'm gonna do this green with gold jewelry and the green camo mix ducks. And then I have a second outfit. The second outfit is going to be something a little different. I'm going to do like the glittery gold silver jewelry with a black top, crop top, and then light colored jeans. I like the unbuttoned look with the black high top dunks. I think it's going to be super cute. So this is the fit with the green dunks. I think it's going to be a look. We're about to go take the pictures, so wish me luck. I don't know how I'm going to feel because I don't have lashes on, but it's a journey. We're loving ourselves. That's how you be that girl. Question, tell me what you think about me. I buy my own diamonds and I buy my own rings. Only ring your celly when I'm feeling lonely. When it's all over, please get up and leave. Question, tell me how you feel about this. Try to control me, boy, you get dismissed. Pay my own car note and I pay my own bills. Always 50 50 in relationships. The shoes on my Hey y'all, I am back. I just got off work and it was honestly pretty freaking slow. Right now it's like 3, 3.44, about to be 4 o'clock. I haven't been to the gym yet. I'm going to go around like 8 o'clock because that's when pretty much everybody who just got off work is gone. Probably 7 7 7 30 i'm trying to get there for 7 30. my brandon blackwood bags came in i'm not gonna open on here because i'm doing a different video so the video should be coming out a little bit after this vlog probably the other day brandon blackwood had a sale for the june juneteenth sale it was like literally 50 to 80 percent off some of the bags so i copped two because the other ones well the ones that i wanted had already been sold out but um yeah so i ended up getting two bags super super excited i'm also going to do a tiktok on that as well so you may have seen it on tiktok but 
yeah I'm about to it's like I really want to do well I'm trying to think like because I really want to see them right now I don't know if I'm gonna do an unboxing video or if I'm gonna do like a just like showing the bags I don't know we'll see because I'm really eager so I may have to fill the bag right now the uh, stuff right now but anyways yeah I'm about to watch Aaliyah's video I don't know if y'all watch Aaliyah face yeah, I'm sure y'all watch Aaliyah face basically she came out and she got a Bentley I'm so freaking happy for her she's like literally one of my favorite you she's probably my favorite YouTube she's amazing if you don't watch her you need to watch her I don't know what you're doing but yes hey y'all i'm back um it's six o'clock i'm actually gonna be getting ready to go to the gym in the next 30 minutes um but i wanted to come out here because my teacher emailed us and told us that the grades are out that she, well not the grades that are, they're not posted but she updated them within like our grade sheet on blackboard so i just want to come here and do a little um transparent moment and tell y'all that literally how the other day I, don't, I think I was on here and I was basically saying like how you can fail a court like fail a, a test and think that it's the end of the world but you can literally come back like bigger and better and do amazing um just from one test you know what I'm saying and this class only had three exams one big exam and like six um worksheets that we did okay y'all you can literally come back from anything let me let me show y'all oh, so annoying anyways i'm gonna insert a picture right here since it's literally tripping but i made an 86 i have an 86 in the course so that's a high b that's a high b i think it's a b plus Anyways, y'all, I got a high B. I have an 86.2. Um, so, yeah, 86.2, and I failed one exam. I made a 77 on my first exam, and then I made a 70 on my second exam. And in nursing school, a seven, anything below a 75 is technically failing. So I did not pass one of my exams, and then I came back and I made an 84 on my third exam. And then, like I was telling y'all, I made a 89 on my HESI. So I'm about to log in here and show y'all that just because I never showed y'all that. And I want to show y'all. Hopefully it logs. It, it, I mean, hopefully it shows on the screen because I really need y'all to see that. Okay. So basically, you see I made a 1,001 and the class average is at 827 and my conversion score is at 89.8. So I think we should round that over to a 90. And then I'm in the 81 percentile. So what we needed was a 900 and I succeeded far beyond that. Okay, 101 points. And yeah. So basically, guys, you should never stop. Keep going. Keep studying. You're going to do amazing. Just literally, as long as you do the things that you need to as long as you do the things you need to do as far as, you know, like not going out. You Sometimes you got to literally put those things aside because it's always going to be out there you know what i'm saying there are so many things that i gave up within this month to study and i'm just so grateful that i did that because i knew what i needed to do even though i didn't want to do it i still did it and the work literally paid off so i'm just so grateful to god and so grateful and it's literally just such an exciting moment i'm not gonna get you know emotional on here because that's just not me but it's just such a full circle moment um literally being at this point you know because i've waited for so long and i'm just so excited to be a senior and to finally be working soon so yeah just keep on growing girls because the work gonna always pay off and it's gonna always show but anyways i'm about to get ready to go to the gym and i'm trying to think what i'm gonna eat after because it's gonna be late but i'll probably just try to like get a smoothie or something but smoothie king and everything gonna be closed i don't know we'll figure it out but i'm about to get ready i'll see y'all in a bit oh and i also want to say i just finally finished Aaliyah's video and y'all she's such a she's so amazing like she literally shows other um girls of color that there's so much opportunity out there you know what i'm saying and i'm just so grateful that we have 
women like Kyra and Aaliyah and Tasha and Brianna and Alexis. Like, we have so many girls out there doing the thing. So, yeah. Shout out to them. She see money all around me. I look like I'm the man. But I was down and out like last week Tell me where have you been? Yeah. Came out of yeah. hiding, girl Don't act like I'm your man You just a fan You don't hold me No, 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 no Don't hold no me Spillin' that nigga with a sick ass thump and a slick ass flow uh -huh. Catch up with your brown me, nigga ain't a plan when I'm coming for the kitty Got my folk got it down, do it for my niggas in the ghost right there Do it for my niggas in the ghost right there Niggas got killed for the boy, live with dreams and the kills And they watchin' for the boy right now, goddamn, what a time, what a year We are what them young boys feel I killed, never be killed, that's real, no lie You can tell it from my peers right now Bitch, you wanna fuck me down Bitch, you wanna love me down Girl, you can't tie me down like Ray J said, but no How was your first day back? Hey y'all, we just got at the gym. It's not even, I don't know what's going on. They were not focused. I gave it to you. Hey y'all, we're about to go get a smoothie from Smoothie King. We just left the gym. I'm super tired. But I'm tired, but I got a lot of energy now. But which way is the time we go? I don't know. I guess you can go out that way. Get the uh, small stretch and flex. Small stretch and flex? Okay, which one? The um. Tart cherry. Tart cherry. Oh, all right, what else for you? That's a medium high intensity workout. Chocolate cinnamon? Yes, ma'am. Yes, please. Yeah, we'll see. I got the, what's it called? Chocolate something. Chocolate cinnamon. Mmm. Is it good? Hey y'all, so I just got out the shower. Well, I the bath, so I took the bath. But um, I kind of want to do a face mask. Let me turn this music down. I haven't done one in a long time. It's a sheet one. It's the hydrating sheet mask by Birch Bees. So yeah, I think I'm going to put this on while I wax my, my um, oil my scalp. And I want to write in my journal because that's what I feel like. That's when I feel like I'm that girl. Whenever I go back and think about ooh, ooh, Hello? what I've been doing. So I'm about to put on this mask that's dripping. Okay, how does it open? Oh my god, I don't know if I'm feeling this, y'all. Hey, y'all, I need to cut some slits in this because I feel like I cannot. I can't. I cannot. So this face mask I got is supposed to be a hydrating sheet mask with a watermelon. I feel like I look so crazy right now, but whatever. So I already washed my face with my regular face wash and then I just um, put this on top to kind of like see if it really gives my face that hydrating feeling. Hopefully it doesn't break me out. All I can do is five minutes because this is making me feel weird. Okay, y'all, so I just took it off. Is it giving glowy skin? My skin feels a little... It feels good. It just feels a little sticky, but I'm going to go ahead and top it off with my favorite night skincare. I feel like these are my holy grail. The Ordinary. I put this in my skincare um, video, so if you haven't seen that, you should definitely go watch my skincare video. And then this Superfood... Um, Glow by Youth for the People, Youth to the People. So I'm just going to put a little bit of this on because it kind of evens out the skin tone. So I'm just going to put a little bit of that on. 
Oh my god, my face feels so good now. WTF. So now I'm just about to listen to my music while I vibe and drink my wine and journal. Yeah, one thing I'm so excited about is how my palette has changed because in college, me and my friends used to be drinking cupcake wine, okay? <sighs> no offense to the girls that still drink cupcake wine because it's a good wine. It's very sweet. Do y'all see that glow on my face? Baby. Anyways, no offense to the girls, but now I love a semi-dry, like a blend. This is a nice blend, y'all. It's like it get it's like it cleanses your palate. It's still a little sweet, but it's like dry. It's perfect. So perfect. Alright y'all, I'm about to go to work and I'll see y'all when I get back. Hey y'all, I just got home from work about an hour ago. Um, I just filmed the unboxing video for the bags that I got. Super cute bags. I love the bags. I always love Brandon Blackwood. But one of my bags came scratched, so I'm a little pressed because I paid... I mean, it was a discounted purse. But that don't mean that it should be scratched. You know what I'm saying? It was a discounted sale. Like, it was a sale that I got the purse on. That doesn't mean that the bag should be scratched. But I emailed them and they told me that I can't return it because it's final sale. But that um, they can give me a discount on the next purchases that I make. So I'm kind of like, okay. But I'm still kind of like, my bag is scratched. But it'll be okay. I mean, I know it's there. But Ryan keeps trying to say like, it's not that bad, it's not that big of a scratch. It's like whatever, but we're about to go to Ryan's house. Hey y'all, um, this is my first time coming on camera today. It's actually Friday already, which is crazy. The week flew by. It's 5.22. I didn't come on this morning because my lights went out. And we didn't have no electricity till like 12. And then after that I went to the gym. And y'all been seeing me go to the gym like two times already, so well in this vlog so i was like okay so yeah today was a really good day um i'm gonna be getting cute in a little bit because i'm going to dinner with my friend michaela she um her birthday dinner is today so we're gonna be going to dinner but i cannot find nothing to wear i've literally been looking and i just got tired of looking so I'm kind of right now at the point where I'm just kind of like trying to think of something. Okay, y'all. So I just finished my makeup. Um, I'm about to try on the outfit now. The lipstick looks super red, but it's really not that red, y'all. It's like burgundy. But this is the makeup. Um, it's super cute. I just did some kind of updo. We'll see how it looks with the outfit. But this is the outfit. I'm going to just do this burgundy top with black shorts my black puffer bag and these nike dunks high top okay y'all outfit change because the outfit looked too regular like it didn't look dressy enough so i just went ahead and put this top on i'll show you in a second but i'm trying to put some new lipstick on because the red don't match what you change you change your lipstick too much yeah, because the brown didn't match. I mean, the red didn't match. So I'm just going to put brown. So I don't know if it's going to stay. If not, a ponytail is fine too. 
because it's already kind of mixed like in a ponytail. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, y'all. So this is our fit. Can y'all see me? This is the fit. I'm just wearing this brown paisley shirt I've worn before. And I'm wearing, let me get my purse out of the way. I'm wearing these regular black jeans. They kind of flare at the bottoms. And then I'm going to pair it with this black puffer bag from Brandon Blackwood. And you just pull it like this. Super cute. So I think I'm going to do that with this ebony wood. Thank you. Fuck a pigeonhole, I'm a night out, it's a different mode. I'ma have to make a paint of six on a pinky toe. Heard you with a shooting guard, just let a nigga know. I would have your court side, not the middle row. All good love in a minute though. I can't stress about no bitch cause I'm a timid soul. Plus I'm cooking up ambition on the kitchen stove. Pot start to bubble, see the suds, that shit good to go. Oh Sam Suave. Hey y'all, this is the end of the vlog. I just wanted to come out here and say thank y'all so much for watching this vlog and um, subscribing if you did. And I can't wait to see y'all in the next video. Um, I love y'all.